Today we're reviewing Starburst Gummies and Starburst Gummy Sours. Hey guys, what's up? I'm Greg, he's Q, together with Mr. Happy0121, and today we're reviewing Starburst Gummies. Now, before we get too far into this, there's people that's been asking. There is no Jack in a Box within 500 miles of us. Jack in a Box came out with a new breakfast menu, which, you know, in the best interest of you and me and him, it's probably best that there isn't a jack-in-the-box nearby because you would be subjected to th such thrilling videos as watching us eat bacon and eggs. It would be like, hey guys, jack-in-the-box has a new breakfast menu. Here's bacon and eggs or fried potatoes. That's what it would be because there's nothing else to review. In all honesty, I mean, if you need to watch us review bacon and eggs, we can do that. I can go fry some up, but that's what would happen if Jack in the Box was here. We would eat bacon and eggs and like fried potatoes. I've already seen like 12 of these videos out, people eating bacon and eggs. It's a revelation. When I was a kid, Jack in the Box was like synonymous with garbage. It was a poor man's McDonald's. And then they killed a bunch of people, allegedly, Whoa. with like diseased meat. Like E. coli? Yeah, something like that. It's wow. it's on Wikipedia. Look it up. But people today somehow have forgotten all of that, and now they're reviewing bacon and eggs. Anyway, we're not doing that. We're doing Starburst gummies. We're taking a page from those two uh, chodes over on the Mr. Dark channel. <laughs> we're reviewing some candy. I bet those two dudes would be pissed off if we beat them to this. Probably. We're going to start with the Starburst gummy regular flavor. We've got orange, strawberry, lemon, and cherry. Now, unlike our usual three bites, we're gonna do one of each flavor at least. I don't know that we're gonna subject you guys to watching us eat every flavor, because come on, how exciting is that? That goes right up there with bacon and eggs. We're starting with cherry, lemon, orange. Last but not least, or perhaps least, we haven't tried yet, strawberry. Now for the sour flavor, we're gonna change it up. It's got strawberry, blue raspberry, watermelon, and cherry. We're gonna uh, try both, tell you which one's better that we think is better, and then we're gonna give you our favorite flavors of each package. Just a potpourri of review goodness. It's exactly what you would expect from a sour. It looks like it's covered in sugar. Typical. Typical, basic. We're going with the blue raspberry first. Watermelon, strawberry, last but not least, cherry. I'm surprised by the outcome of this. What grade do you give the Starburst gummies? 88. What grade do you give the Starburst sour gummies? 87. That's why I'm surprised. He is the sours guy, I am not. Probably in a way of an explanation we'll get to in a minute. These weren't that sour. I give the original an 86. I give the sour an 89. What was your favorite flavor out of both packages? Oh, the blue raspberry. Mine was a tie. The blue raspberry from the sours and actually the cherry from the, uh, the original. The cherry was the one in this entire package that came closest to capturing the flavor of a Starburst. The orange tasted like orange, but it didn't taste like an orange Starburst. It just tasted like gummy candy. If you would have put it in a different package and wouldn't have told me it was Starburst, I wouldn't have known. But the cherry, it had the flavor for what whatever that flavor is. Now, the sours weren't that sour. You hated the watermelon. Yeah, it was tasted funky. I liked overall, the, all four of those were superior to the other. The three... Besides the cherry in this, the three flavors besides the cherry in this Starburst were all just run of the mill to me. But the uh, gummy sours overall hold their own. So I guess I'll be taking the gummy sour pack at the end of this video. You'll be taking the uh, normies with you. Fair enough. Facebook shout outs now up to 580 likes. Adam Gilbert. Nikki Thomas. Thanks guys. We appreciate your patronage. It means a lot to us. Especially when you sit through videos of watching us eat gummy Starburst. Good work, fellas. We will be back in two days with an actual fast food item what? of some sort. What is it? 
I don't know yet, oh. but it will come from a fast food place. It will not be packaged candy, and it will not be Jack in the Box. So that t takes out two options. We are still looking for the monster. The monster is my white whale. If we can find that new monster drink, it may not be fast food, but that's very iffy. Until next time, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. You can find us on all social media, Mr. Happy 0121. Stay vigilant.